friends if you have recently acquired your Canadian citizenship and had travel plan I know many of you are stressed out with the recent development where the e-visa have been stopped till further notice and if you're looking for it even OCI it has a wait time the turnaround time of three months once you do the surrender certificate process and then you apply for OCI it's easily going to be three months turnaround now uh, don't get stressed out you still have an option to travel with your India passport. And uh, you have a grace period of three months. So if you have, say, acquired your Canadian citizenship on 20 September 2023, you have three months from that time to surrender the certificate. Okay? So uh, within which you can go and do the surrender. Now, uh, if you're traveling to India, carry your India passport, that will allow you to entry into India. Once you're there in India, you can go to the government website, which I'm showing on the screen. And then uh, here you can initiate for the surrender of India passport. You can see in the prescribed fees, 500 rupees only. If you're doing it from Canada, it is much more expensive. And uh, once you do that, you will also have to make a visit to FRR office, the Foreign Regional Registration Office, which are available in most of the media cities. Uh, here, you have to go and get an exit visa. This is a mandatory thing if you have traveling back from India to Canada on Canadian passport. Okay, so in this scenario, you have both Indian passport, which you have not surrendered, and the Canadian passport, which you have recently acquired after becoming the citizen. So, uh, with this process, this is uh, you know, completely safe and you would not be on the wrong side of the law. Now, if you are exceeding more than three months, you're holding the India passport and you're traveling, then there is a hefty fine. So, uh, don't be on the wrong side of the law, be on the right side of the law. So, I hope. Uh, this video helps you uh, and gives you the confidence for you to travel. So all you have to remember is carry your India passport, do a travel with India passport, and as soon as you are in India, within that three months period, go and surrender your India passport, get your surrender certificate, which will take uh, no, uh, which will be handed over to you almost immediately. Unlike here, it uh, takes long time to get this and certificate and uh, take the um, exit visa from FRR. So once you do that with your Canadian passport, you'll be able to travel back. So all the relevant things are in the description. Hope you like this video and do share with other friends for them to know that it is still possible to travel within the and in what I've mentioned. Thanks for watching.